This is Affinity for Revit by Trelligence. The video will demonstrate the process of loading a schematic design from Affinity directly into Revit. This process ensures all the program properties, components, requirements, and notes are associated to the rooms in Revit for the transition from design to documentation. The files retain their links so there is constant program to design comparison throughout the duration of the project. This is the Affinity application showing an existing Affinity file that contains both the program and design of an office building. In this view, spaces are shown within their respective groups. The required program quantities and areas, along with the actual quantities and areas, and their differences are shown. These actual numbers are what is laid out in the design and gives you a quick visual of the program to design compliance. By enabling the Show Violations icon, I can graphically see in red where the program is not being met. By selecting the Design tab, I can see that the building has six stories created in this file. Opening the Story 1 view, notice that the program spaces have been laid out along with the circulation spaces. By moving back up to the building level, I can change the view to see the entire building in 3D. In the Revit application, I've opened a new project file. I renamed Level 1 to Story 1 to match the corresponding level in Affinity and removed any other levels that existed within the model. The Affinity buttons are located in the Add-ins tab as a direct plug-in to Revit. By selecting the Project Load icon, I will locate the existing Affinity file that I just viewed and click Open. A Settings dialog box appears allowing the choice of rooms to be synchronized. I've also selected Walls under the Items to Generate so that walls and not room separation lines are created in the Revit model to enclose the spaces. After selecting OK and Yes to generate the new items, the conversion of the Affinity design to the Revit model will commence. Once the process is complete, notification of a successful synchronization will occur. Notice in the browser that during the synchronization, new levels were created that match the names of the levels within Affinity. Each floor has been created within Revit with walls and rooms placed within the enclosed spaces that match the Affinity design. By selecting a room in the Details icon, you can view or modify all of the information that resides in the Affinity file. All of the program properties, requirements, components, resources, and notes remain linked to the Revit file for the development of the model during production. Following the recent process, you can update the Affinity design to ensure real-time program to design compliance. The complete program can be viewed by selecting the program icon, and you can select the violations icon to view non-compliance of the Revit model. This concludes the video on how a Revit model is created from an Affinity design. Contact us at Trelligence for more information.